Setback knows Carter Becerra as the director of pre-construction, but uh, only Precon knows the real Carter. I asked Carter for weekly training sessions for the team. I guess I should have specified that they be about estimating. Guys, today I want to talk about pumping. Pumping is something we all need to be aware of. Breastfeeding is natural. I, uh, I, I thought today was talking about concrete pumping. Well, we have five women in our pre-construction department. At any one time, half of our department is lactating. And I think it's important for us to know about what's going on with half of our team. So I thought it would be appropriate to have a breast pump and understand just what makes up the mechanics of breastfeeding. And uh, Carter, yes, I can't Jim. find breast pumping anywhere in the Timberline assemblies. Julian, what's important is that we understand that these, where these go and how these function. That is what's important. He did provide the conversion chart. Yeah, Carter's a big advocate of diversity, but not typical diversity goals. So are you guys all familiar with diversity? Mm -hmm. It's how you calculate electrical load for all of the appliances and equipment that's plugged into electrical. I want to talk that. about diversity, Dane, because I'm bothered. I don't think we're really a diverse enough group. Carter, I think we're very diverse. I think we're the most diverse section in the group. So we're obviously not talking about power diversity. It all depends on how you look at it, Miranda. Got a couple black guys, Asian, got a Hispanic. Got a gay guy, lesbian. Carter, uh, I'm not gay. And, um, and I'm married to a man. You know, uh, you're from California. I mean, what's the difference? Um, Courtney, I apologize, you're feminist, so. I look around the room. Brunette, brunette, gray, brunette, brunette used to be brunette. Guys, I, I just don't see anybody that's blonde here. I, I've made a decision. This has to change. I, I think Corey and Mina, they need to dye their hair. What do you think? <laughs> Better than me. What color? Can they expense it? <laughs> we need more blonde in our group. Carter has a bizarre fascination with Tony Romo. Okay, folks, we have an interview coming up. And I don't want any of you young pups to be nervous in front of our owners. So, if you're asked a question or you feel a little bit uptight, just relax. Um, it's Think about... WWTRD. What what does WWTRD stand for? Shannon, what would Tony Romo do? What what Tony Romo? It's like he's do. a brother from another mother. Carter's very protective of Precon's reputation. Okay, guys, lessons learned. It's been a good lessons learned meeting. You know, gang. We've won a few projects this past year, but we really bombed on quite a lot. I mean, it's been a tough year. You really can't do that in this economy. I've been thinking, we need a scapegoat. We need somebody we can blame. I think I've got the perfect answer for that. Beck Architecture. Amen. Uh, but our last project wasn't an integrated project even. Well, an important detail, Courtney. It's really not relevant. You see, when a project is lost, we need to be talking about how bad the design was. 
We need to be talking about it in the kitchens. We need to talk about it in break rooms, the bathrooms, the copy rooms. And let people know just how much that design stunk. It's not our fault that the estimate sucked. I mean, with enough hype, people will forget there was even an estimate done. Classic case of when under duress and the owner asks you a question, your, your, your Hail Mary pass comment is, we got it covered. Mm -hmm. The biggest lie on the table. <laughs> <laughs> Should we do something? Oh. <laughs> Could not agree more. Very well put. End of meeting. Thank you. <laughs>